I crawled out the gate and I'm holding the gate because I'm afraid that he's still going to come out to get me. She says she felt its teeth sink into her leg. Police are investigating after a North Braddock woman said she was attacked by a dog in her friend's neighborhood. Ralph Iannotti is live tonight with the story. Ralph. Yeah, thanks very much, Susan. Tonight, this incident is under investigation by uh, North Braddock Police. The dog uh, attack took place last Sunday night near the victim's home after the owner of the dog sent a message to, to the woman asking for some cigarettes. I was so afraid. This dog's face is the size of two pit bulls. Angel White said she was walking across the street from her home to her neighbor's house the other night when his dog, who was not tied on a leash, started charging directly towards her. And I had on like flip-flops, so I tried to climb the fence. It was their fence of the owners of the dog. And when I got almost to the top, he grabbed the back of my right leg and I felt his teeth sinking into my leg. So I fell over into their yard. White told me she did nothing to provoke the dog. She started screaming. His owner tried to get the dog off of her, but the pit bull wouldn't let go. He bit both of her legs and literally took a chunk out of her left leg. The punctures were in. I felt him when he sunk into this leg, like really deep, like he got it down, like where I could see the white meat. Like I'm, I'm feeling blood coming down like leggings so I could feel it coming through my pants. She described her neighbor as a friend, someone she's known for years, and she can't understand why now he won't provide proof that the dog has had a rabies vaccination. I can't sleep at night. My main thing is I don't know what I'm facing. I don't know if this dog has rabies as we speak. Who knows, but it's going to be a painful experience for me, and all you had to do was show paperwork to prove, and that would ease my mind for me. They have to give me the shots. Now, tonight, no word on the status of the investigation from police. An animal control has been made aware of the situation. We're live tonight. I'm Ralph Iannotti, KDKA-TV News.